Senator Tim Scott's words paint a vivid picture of his unwavering faith in miracles, his firm belief that the United States is not a racist country, and his sharp criticism of democratic leadership in urban areas. I know this is going to offend the liberal elites every time I say it, it offends them. But let me say it one more time. America is not a racist country. No, we're not. But if you were looking for racism today, you'd find it in cities run by Democrats. Look on the south, look on the south side of Chicago. Poor black kids trapped in failing schools. Thousands shot every single year, including one of my former interns, Daquan. But there's good news. It's conservative values that restores hope. It's Republican policies that lifts people up. I place my faith in miracles before Saturday. You better start living right now. Tim Scott's powerful statement echoes deeply with conservatives who hold faith, divine intervention, and hope close to their hearts. His bold proclamation that America is not a racist country underscores a conservative conviction in the inherent goodness of the nation. This viewpoint can be seen as an affirmation of the progress made in overcoming racial divisions and celebrating American exceptionalism. Scott's pointed critique of Democrat-led cities, highlighting issues like failing schools and high crime rates in places like Southern Chicago, underscores his argument that liberal policies have fallen short in urban communities. Many interpret this as a testament to the superior effectiveness of Republican solutions. The phrases, restoration of conservative values and Republican policies uplift people, encapsulate a belief in individual responsibility, limited government, and free market solutions as essential keys to improving social conditions.